Milwaukee, Wisconsin. The residents of a high-rise condominium have gathered in a park across the street to witness an unusual event. Here we are, we're all assembled. A helicopter is removing a giant air conditioning unit from the roof of their 25-story building. So far, things are going smoothly. But one of the tenants, Sylvia Schwark, is concerned. I just had a feeling this was going to happen. I just had a feeling something was going to happen. Pilot Ben Moore maneuvers the chopper above the building and slowly pulls the 2,000-pound refrigeration unit away from the roof. Then, without warning, the tail rotor stalls, sending the chopper into a dangerous spin and forcing the pilot to release his one-ton payload. The air conditioning unit slams to the ground. Ben tries to regain control, but it's no use. The helicopter plummets from the sky. The pilot hangs on for dear life as the aircraft nose dives into the ground. The mangled helicopter teeters precariously over the edge of a boat launch. God, I had a feeling something was going to happen. I just had a feeling. I didn't know how they were even going to get him out. It seemed like if they would touch it, that it would teeter into the water. Crewmen from a nearby Coast Guard station rush to the scene to rescue the pilot before the copter explodes. Using extreme caution, they secure the smoldering aircraft and search desperately for Ben, who is still trapped inside the twisted wreckage. To their amazement, he not only survives his horrifying 400-foot plunge, he also avoids the bystanders below. It was very hard to control the aircraft. I really thought that I was going to punch in and that would be the end of my life. When I look at it and see the video, yes, I feel very lucky that I... I'm still alive.